More reactions have been coming in on the global terror group Al-Qaeda that has jumped into the hijab controversy. Remember that it erupted in January 2022 and at least till the time the Karnataka High Court came out at its verdict, there were communal tensions brewing in the state of Karnataka. So in this latest video, the Al-Qaeda chief now, Ayman al-Zawahiri, is expressing support for Muskan Khan. The girl whose visuals had gone viral, she was wearing a full-body veil, remember, was shouting slogans during the hijab controversy in Karnataka. Now, this is the latest video released of Zawahiri. He was actually rumoured dead in 2020, but clearly he's confirmed suspicions that he's still alive. So what does he say in this video? He praises Muskan Khan, who had confronted a group of students who were uh, protesting against the veil in educational institutions. She had shouted aloud, Allahu Akbar slogans while responding to the Jai Shri Ram chants of the students that you can see in the background as well till she was then escorted away uh, by some of the staff members. So then what exactly would Al-Qaeda chief say on this uh, issue in Karnataka? This is a nine-minute video titled and accompanied by a poster where this image has been used of the girl and it reads the noble woman of India referring to her. Now, the video has been released by the official Al-Qaeda mouthpiece, as Shabab Media. Now, remember, he's a terrorist, Al-Zawahiri. And he calls the girl a sister. And clearly, this is now being looked at uh, by the agencies and by the government. I'm now joined live in the special broadcast by B.C. Nagesh. He is the education minister of Karnataka. And he had been speaking to during the hijab row as well. Uh, so, if you can hear me now, the Karnataka government earlier had alleged a PFI, CFI, or other radical groups' role during the hijab row. But this is a global designated terror group that has also come out and reacted, even expressed support. How seriously is the government in Karnataka looking at this video that has been released of the Al Qaeda chief, Mr. Nagesh? Uh... This is unfortunate that girls have been brought in. And as you know that after Modi took over the charge of the country, such people are unable to do anything in the country to disturb the peace and uh, harmony of the country. Even not even one terrorist has entered the country and has disturbed, uh, no bomb has been blasted throughout the country when they are unable to come in and do some peace disturbing things, they have selected girls like such girls to, to disturb the peace of the country. This is very unfortunate. And the girls have become the scapegoat of such organization. But uh, I am confident that Karnataka can hand, uh, handle this issue. Our home department is were strong enough to deal with such things. Sir, the court had settled the hijab issue. It had mandated uniform for all in classroom. It uh, appeared that peace was back for the coastal state and specifically for the Udupi area. But this video may also generate fear of unsettling Karnataka again. How will your government then, sir, ensure that no communal disturbance takes place in Karnataka again? Uh, BJP government is ruling Karnataka for the last two and a half years. Not even a single communal violence has taken place, even at the time of hijab. Court has held the Karnataka's education, Karnataka's education department notification according to the Act and Rule of Edu Karnataka Education Act. So there, uh, there were protest, some protests encouraged by some political parties. But law, we have not faced any law and our problem because of hijab. And sir, we are not going to face also. Sir, do you, and my final question, sir, do you think that uh, there needs to be central and state agencies and your government that need to ensure that such videos uh, do not lend any more radicalization or brainwashing in the state with these Im uh, images that have been emerging, sir? See, as we had earlier tried to handle this case very carefully and we were convincing the girls not to indulge in such activity. Some political party encouraged such girls, so Campus Friend of India and uh, People Friend of India, 
took an advantage of the support of the political parties and they wanted okay. to see that communal harmony has been disturbed and girls' education will be disturbed. But whatever they tried, they were unable to do it. And even we are conducting the SLC examination okay. so peacefully. And 98.8% uh, of the girls are attending the examinations. Mm. Boys, 97.2% of the boys are attending and 98.8% of the girls are attending. Okay. Okay. So this issue is almost settled and no one can disturb the harmony of the... Good state. to hear that, sir. Good to because hear that. But with this uh, video that's emerging, of course, it will generate some fear as well. But if the government is assuring, they'll look at it. It's important as well. That was B.C. Nagesh, Education Minister from Karnataka.